Welcome back. Today we're going to see if we can get this 1926 Khan baritone saxophone up and running. She's been sitting here for about uh, 12 hours now and we'll see if we can get her going. She's got the uh, bare brass finish. You can tell because um, the way she is. And uh, down here you'll find a serial number and if you put that into the bleep bloop Google computer -inator, it'll tell you that this horn was made in Elkhart, Indiana in 1926. That's a good year for Khan. She's got the, the low B flat on her, no low A, or if there was, it fell off a couple decades back. But I think this is a low B flat horn originally. You can see it's got everything. It's even got a high F and a high E on it. Such luxury. None of them fork keys though. Come around here, you got a got a somebody replaced on that neck receiver here and the guard. You can see that mouth juice uh, release valve still good. Gotta change that every once in a while. Down here, you can see uh, you can see some places where I've done some professional repair work uh, for high visibility. That's when you're playing at night. You want to make sure other saxophones can see you. Found a sound maker happener down on the floor somewhere. Not sure where. It says Van Dorn to about 98.37% sure. I don't know how old this rate is. So first thing when you're putting together an old horn like this, you want to make sure the sound maker happener is still good. So yeah, that tastes just like burnt Q-tips and boiled rabbit. So you can see here, we've got the original neck with the teeth clampulator on it. This is a Van Dorn V5 five cylinder, uh, B95, although this is old enough now, it's probably a B94.78 at this point. Uh, we're going to take our sound maker happener, we're going to put her on there, any old which way is fine, doesn't really matter. We're going to put our vibrational dampener on there, tighten her up real good, and uh, we're ready to fire her up. Now that we got her all set up, we're going to go ahead and uh, get her started up and see if we can blow the cobwebs out of this thing. Go ahead and strap in here for safety. Adjust properly, comfort is key. Alright, let's see if we can get this, uh, this horn to blow again. Bring the thunder! <laughs> she's clapping her a little bit. She's good. Well there you have it. This 1926 beauty con baritone saxophone brought back to life after sitting 12 long hours. Uh, if you've got a con yourself or you have a little different setup, leave bloop down there in the comments let me know. Don't forget to uh, like, a find, and subscribe, and to the channel. Uh, and, uh, you know, have yourself a good one.